actually told him why isn't there an app version. He told me literally that is the app it, version. It makes yeah. it. It's like coded, so like if you pull it up through your homepage, like it yeah, does it, have the it's app. It's like an app. Super great stuff. Check it out if you're looking for any tournaments here in SoCal. SoCalSmash.net, the number one place to find locals here in SoCal. Anyways, let's get into it here, man. We're at this local. K9 who punched in his ticket to winner's final. Nito who punches his to winner's final. These two are destined to meet. K9 has actually been up on Nito, like you said. Yeah, alright, so game to game one. No damage done. K9 just playing the patient game that's been working out for him all night. Uh, with punish Hadoken, though. Uh, K9 actually backing off, expecting that the up air wasn't true and Nito would be able to focus through it and just backing off. Got his damage deal, but no punish. Yeah, could use a double jump to hit him, come and mix up over the nair there. I like that option. He's looking for spacing here, and Nito kind of has to give a little bit more respect to K9 because Wolf damage with spacing was really, really, really hurtful. Yeah. K9's been playing this one so well so far, just weaving in and out, getting his damage. But not overextending because if he overextends, things like that happen. Where well, he almost dies to destroy you at such an early percent, only at 77 post hit. Yeah, the forward tilt. Nice. He rolls away. Gives a little bit of little, gives a little bit of center stage away, but that's much better than losing the shield. Yeah. Oh, smash to the punish. He's got the inside scoop on how to beat Ken here. I like it. Kind of forcing Nita to kind of respect Blaster. That'll buy Cannon enough time to come back and take retakes on the stage. Nice. Good use of the reflector coming back to line down. Yep, that'll do it. He yeah. reads the roll get up. He, he didn't even have to read it. Like, the auto turnaround coming in clutch right there for Nito, able to confirm that stock. Yeah, Nito had auto correct, dude. Yeah. Auto correct. Nice, good focus attack, but Kanan is not done with him just yet. Blaster oh. to put him off the stage, and the down smash does reach the hurt box that Ken does have when he goes for Tatsu. Okay, man. Nito looking to respond in kind. I like it, 58%. Look at how much pressure he's trying to keep against Kanan. Right? He wants to make sure he's at the ledge, gets the cross up here, side switch, <laughs> and that buys Kanan a little bit of time to come back to the other side. I uh, grab down throw, doesn't get the dash chat, tries for an instant dash chat. Uh, if you do it with C scope, C stick, sometimes you're too fast going to dash to get F tilt instead. Mm -hmm. That was such a beefy war. It's nice to go for, but unfortunately, nothing. There's a parry. Nice. He wanted to go for percent. That would have been really good. Either way. Nice, trying to set up for back, and he's got K9 at the ledge at 142. The shield looking mighty small here. K9 inches in with the back throw. Wait for, wait for the recovery. I was going to say, he might be waiting for that recovery to go for the down smash. He wanted yeah. to two frame this man. But good poke through the stage right there from Nito. Can I keep him alive? How much longer is the real question, though? No. <coughs> Ew. I, I'd cough too, man. <laughs> that really hurt. That one, that was kind of gross, but gonna keep Nido alive in this game, puts Kane on his last stock, and we know how volatile Ken is. He's not out of this game, especially with some rage. Yeah, 121 to 131. Kenan is making sure that he's not gonna take as much percent, or even a Ken combo. Oh, right, starts off slowly here, but I like it though. He falls off, goes to the other side to try to finish up the work here. You know what, that was good patience from Kane though, because in that situation, Nido was looking for Kane to air dodge away, and he may have been able to kill him for it. But instead, by doing neutral air dodge in place, Nito not ready for it, not gonna punish it. Nice. Kieran gets the nair. There's a tumble, but it's not enough for Kieran to go for a down smash. So he just checks him with the blaster. Nito looking to steal this man's game oh here, my but God. he misses the sweet spot. And he's dead. And he lost this with a side no jump. No jump. And like we were saying, Nito with the rage, he has every opportunity in the world to bring it back, and he does. I can, I can read K9's mind. He's like, oh man, that was some bars. Oh, that yeah. was some bars. Yeah, that was. Everybody else can see the screen about you, but that was some horse, man. You can see it in his face. It's got a little bit of sweat in there, too. All right, let's go to the next game here. Nido with the first point on the board. Only one player can punch their ticket to grand finals here. OC is going to be the one to actually reach the time slot. Tell his boss, yo man, I'm going to grand finals, baby. 
Alright, here comes the down throw, gets the dash track after, and a forward tilt, puts Nito off stage. Quick response here from Nito, but a nice aggressive landing there from K9 is gonna just keep the pressure on to Nito. Nice, 60% already to K9, K9 at 102. He had it the last game here, but like you said, right, he still had to show respect to Nito. All right, Nito puts the K9 in the corner here. K9 able to come back. I like it. He's kind of keeping up the same game plan. Doesn't uh, double jump to mix up the nightmare. It's kind of one of those things you have to do against Nito and Kanas also. Both both the player and the character, right? Mix up your timings around him. Oh, man. Look at, like, Daigo Umehara with his parries here. A third one and a punish. He said Chun-Li had kicks, too. Punish those as well as I can punish these. Back air, yep. Catches his man going for an aerial option off the ledge. Usually one of Nito's options to come in with an aerial. Uh, K9 Ooh. looking to bring this man all the way across the stage. I thought Nito was getting good there. Yeah, that was quite the corner carry from K9. And yeah, that's exactly what he needed right now. Yeah. Everything is just going so in favor of K9. But, you know, only needs to go in favor of Nito a couple times like we saw earlier. <laughs> Literally, like, sometimes it can be, like, win neutral twice, and you might be on the wrong side of Ken. Figuratively, Ken and literally. Ken is just a Smash 4 kill, He is. That's, that was a Smash 4 kill. Actually, you know what's kind of crazy? Even in Tekken 7, they do suffer against Shoto's with Akuma. I know. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, so people in Tekken know the, Te what it's Tekken's like. Tekken's my other, like, fine game that I follow. Man, Akuma. Are crazy. Yeah. I'm sorry, man. It, it ain't only in this game, man. You're suffering out there in Tekken 7. Nice, go forward there. Oh, K9, I'm looking to move in some momentum in there. I saw him get off the seat. He said, I'm trying to finish this off right now. Uh oh. Oh, man, a little bit too far here. He's trying to jump out of the situation. Directional air it? dodge. If he holds the DI right, but he does not, he actually will lose the stock there. Damn. And again, K9 is so. Heavily commanding that game, and then it just kind of slipped away from him. He panicked. He went for a directional air dodge, and that brought him right back into Nito's loving arms. I feel like DI could have helped him survive on that one, but I'm also not too sure. He was at the ledge at 5%. There wasn't. He wasn't yeah, going yeah, anywhere. he wasn't going anywhere. But the next game. Number three, still on Pokemon Stadium. Number two here. Down throw, nice. Get his dash attack. Blaster. I'm like looking for a couple empty hops. Trying to get that forward air coming in here. Slowly convert into some higher percent. So far, once again, things looking good for Kanan. 60%, but here's an opening for Nito. Yeah. Down tilts into the Tatsu. Not necessarily as much damage as he would have Kanan has these really good openings, right? But the biggest problem he's been having is when it comes to getting the kills. Sometimes he just overcommits a bit too much, and that's what plays into Nito's hands. That overcommitment. And not only the panic. Oh, directional air dodge. He's going to be fine, though. I'm you, he panicked that situation. Yeah, I mean, he has to get these ledge traps off because I feel like he keeps putting Nito on the ledge, but he's not killing him for it. Nair, and the focus attack was enough, and he gives Nito the stage to come back at the same time. Right there, that's exactly what I'm talking about, where he's not able to convert off of these bad situations Nito's in, and Nito's able to come back. Oh, he gave up so much stage control to allow Nito to put him at the corner. That could have been death. It's right back in the same situation. A 5 percent stage is K9's play here. He's able to get out there with a forwarder, and he comes and strikes back with a blaster. Raw show you. With that raw show you, we'll take it back. Oh, man, oh, this damage. Go. He'll carry this man across the oh. stage. Oh, and he caught the jump, but he's going How? to keep it going. How dare you press advantage what against me? How dare you? He's good, Nito. he's good, he's good. 
Karen striking back here. Slowly but surely, trying to keep composed here. He took a lot of percent, but it's still not out of the cards just yet. The shield, I like it. He's kind of catching on a needle going for those options, and he was spaced enough to actually able to get away from that. With an aerial. Nair brings him right back to the corner, reads the roll get up here. He shouldn't be going off stage, and he didn't have that focus attack. Yeah, exactly. You know, we saw him lose his last stock pretty much off of the No tech! Mm, he tried to go for, an, for a landing there. Big problem with that one is look at how Nito where he was. He was so composed. He's getting overzealous with his kill options, and that's playing into Nito's hands. Yeah, and a quick show you confirmed just for the damage right there. 32% income and 52 now. Down smash? Yep, and he reads the roll get up. Yeah, but a good roll in means Nito staying alive as long as he goes to the other side of the stage, he's not going to die. Yeah. Good use of focus attack cancel. He wanted to mix up his recovery a little bit. And he knows Wolf does not have multi multi hits. But Perry oh, wow. shows the back. He's got down smash, forward tilt. One of those two, uh, back air. One of, one of the three options came out to play here. Nice. Here Starts go. off with the combo percent here. Puts his man in the corner, but he misses the confirm. And this plays right back into Nito's hands. That is, that is and Nito taking it 3 0. Oh, oh, he missed the confirm. <laughs> We started seeing the last game there, those 